All right, some PC online, and this time we are in Dubai, uh, Road A, and I'm rocking this fantastic aerial at home. So let's see this. This race was a straight a race, start, no qualifying, starting in ninth place, five laps. They go. So as usual at the beginning. You don't want to touch anybody looking behind and see those two p1 slow down and then went completely left to leave all these guys you know bump in each other like this boom 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 and all you had to do is just play it safe don't touch anybody and boom already in the third place after less than 40 seconds you know so yeah and in this race the host put the water effects thunderstorm and this was just the beginning and yeah this was just the beginning you saw the p1 spin the p1 always which is actually a pretty bad car in this game ah the p1 sucks in this game so bad the how do you call that the angle of you know where you can, when where you can turn with the P1 is so slow, it's so tiny. It's so tiny. It's like she doesn't even turn. You have to be so accurate with your speed. If you have if you are too fast, it's over. You're out. If you're too slow, you're losing time. You have to be perfectly with everything with the P1. Like yeah, that car sucks in this game don't like it and funny thing is that in other games I like the P1 like uh, Green Autosport I like the P1 uh, in this game I don't like it in Green Autosport I hated the area at home in this game I love it <laughs> uh, that's a fun fact area at home uh, that's a really nice choice uh, for this for this track yeah it's a really nice choice in the World A category, you also have the Pagani Warai, Warai, Warai. I don't know. I don't know how you pronounce it. But yeah, you have the Pagani Warai. That is pretty good. I haven't tried it really yet. But I saw one other guy play with it. Apparently, she is pretty fast. So yeah, you have the Pagani Warai. Uh, the Gumper Apollo S, which is also pretty good. Hmm. What else? Hmm. The Roaster Pagani Roaster is that the Zonda? Yeah, I think it's the Zonda. And yeah, those three cars are pretty good. Three or four cars, but I prefer the Area Atom. Really nice car, and this guy also had the same car same vehicle and with the same uh, you know color and stuff yeah and as you can see it's raining <laughs> pretty bad the rain in this game man when you're racing <laughs> you need to be super extremely accurate with everything you're doing like Accelerating, you have to be uh, gentle with your car. Ooh, ooh. Oh, actually, that wasn't that bad. Okay, right there, he wasn't trying to uh, cut me out. He was just trying to uh, get the control of the car, of the vehicle. Yeah, that happens a lot in this game. Even more when you're racing on the rain, you know. And you have to be super gentle with your car, extremely. Hmm. So, three more laps to go. I'm in the first position, and we are eight people now. So that means eight, nine, ten, eleven, three people left. And yeah, that's what happens most of the time in this game when, especially at the beginning of the race, you know, 
you get discouraged extremely easily in this game because if you get knocked out you pretty much lose most of your chances to get in the poison especially if you're racing against decent driver not even good driver against just decent drivers then say goodbye to the poison <laughs> Uh, unless you are lucky enough because other people will bump into each other and then you will have a chance to get back on track and all that but for the most part when you get knocked out uh, it's very discouraging extremely even more when you have full damage on and where you are qualifying in the first place and you get knocked out in the first corner that is so irritating like that happened to me once uh, it was in uh, uh, Laguna Seca I qualified first because I was I was looking on that weird I qualified first and the host again he put uh, the weather on turn the storm at the beginning of the qualifying laps you know it was it wasn't raining it was perfect and then I did a really good lap and a few minutes later it started raining and you can't like you cannot do fast lap when it's raining so I was lucky on that one qualified first and then in the first corner of the race boom got knocked out I was so pissed man I left immediately immediately the race so yeah, it's very frustrating sometimes. Uh, so oh, I forgot to talk about the settings. The, so the settings for this uh, for this for this race, uh, all assists were on. But don't worry, people. Started from starting from the next video, I will try to do races. With, well, I'll try to find lobbies that have assist off. You know, all the assist off but of course it's probably only going to be on gt3s you know mostly because like i said in my last video or in the video before or in the first video actually it's uh, very hard to play without assist if you're not playing gt3 you know road a without assist whoa whoa you better be on point with everything with all you move the analog stick your speed your uh, breaking points your lines you have to be perfect if you miss only one thing, boom, it's over. Make your car spin. And people are going to overtake. And you're, you're going to get pissed. And you're going to quit the race. And you're going to say, I don't play any more of this. Turn on the assist. Or else I don't play. Something like that. You know. So yeah, but I'll try, I'll try starting from the next race, uh, from the next video. Actually on the next race, after this one, uh, well, what were the settings? I think only, wait, 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 okay, on the next race, I don't remember exactly, oh, damn it but only one assist was turned on i think it was stability control that was turned on well oh yeah yeah we can look on the right side on the uh of the screen right there uh-huh yeah we can check there you see when i break you see abs and then next the second assist and then the third one okay we can check that way yeah that's that's Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. that's a good way to check it yeah so yeah so if i'm telling you if i'm telling you maybe there was no assist in this race just check 
right there when you see the speed when you see uh, all the wheels temperature and all that if you see all these three icons on down there that means all the assists are there if you don't see anything that means there is no assist if you don't see if you only see one of them that means you know there is one assist so yeah i won't necessarily have to tell you well i will tell you but you can check so yeah, that's how we're going to do it my friends and like i told you for this race all the assists were on for the next race if i remember correctly only one was turned on and i think it was stability control which is the one on the middle if i don't uh if i remember correctly i think it is we'll see so 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 the race is about to end and i want to know one thing so for this race i had you know had some topics i, I could talk about but for my future videos i may not have something to say during these races where you know i get in the first place maybe in the second lap and then throughout the race i just i'm just alone in front so let me know in the comments if you want to see the entire race like that because i find it pretty boring you know to only see me alone just driving you know laps after laps without anybody catching up you know uh that probably won't happen that much anymore because like i said starting from the next video i'll be playing in more lobbies well more hard lobbies i'll say but let me know if you want to watch everything or you want me to cut and then or you want me to speed up let me know in the comments so that was it for this first race first place that was cool let's get right into the second race okay second race laguna seca and we are still with the road a and again i picked the area at home so let's see this uh, again like the first race this was a straight race no qualifying straight into the race let's see this and just like i told you only one assist was turned on okay green, green, green. Go, go, go. starting the race and because of uh those i don't know which one which assist is this one i, I don't recognize this one it's not abs for sure uh, maybe it is. Well, I don't know. Anyway, avoiding these crashes. Nice. Slowing down. All right. But sometimes you have to be patient. You know, you don't need to overtake right away. Uh, there was still four laps to go. And yeah. This area atom is pretty fast, but it's not necessarily super easy to control, especially if uh, was it traction control off? I don't know. Well, I think traction control traction control was off, ABS was off, and the last one, which was what's the last one? Mm, because that on the right bottom side of the screen that's the last icon that is on which means this is the last and only assist that is on i don't remember which one it is uh, anyway the car was not as easy to drive as you know when all the assists were on so yeah okay second lap and the car be in front of me was uh how do you call uh how do you call that car um uh, it's a free dlc oh i forgot the name of that car uh well you'll see you'll see and just like the first race in this race too boom i think you can see that 
Thunderstorm. Thunderstorm. And in this track particularly, especially when you're not playing without all the assist on, with this car, well, I don't know about the other cars, but with this car, oh man, <laughs> it can be a nightmare. Uh, you're going to see that. Well, I'm going to tell you. I'll tell you later. Okay, so this part of the track is not really hard. Alright, nice. Same thing for this corner. Nothing. No big deal. But right here. When you, hit, when you take this red corner. Right here. You can spin super easily. See? 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 You can spin extremely easily. And when it's raining. Oh man. Well, especially when it's raining. You can spin super easily there. You have to be very careful. Extremely. So I was catching up Ooh, to this guy in front of me. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. I thought I was going off, off track there. Almost. Okay, nice. I have to be careful here. Aha! I did a mistake. This was my time to overtake. But you need to be careful. Take it easy. Be patient. Uh, what's the name of this car? Oh, I forgot the name of this car. I really forgot. It's something Motorstorm, I think. Or Motorsport something. Uh, well, we'll see at the end of the race. So, even though he did a mistake... Hmm, this guy was pretty good still. See? Look at him. Same thing! Was losing... Well, he was going to lose the control of the car the at the same the pace. Race. Told you guys. But something I really, really hate in this track is the sand. When you go off track, oh god. Oh god. When you go off track in Laguna Seca, the sand is dragging you out. It's dragging you out of the track. You have two wheels on the sand. Oh man, it's gonna drag you on the left side or the right side. Or it's gonna drag you out. It is super annoying. Oh, I hate that. Okay, catching up on him. Not touching him. Nice. Okay. Oh, okay, okay, okay. And right there. See? What the sand is so annoying. Look at this, look at this. I was fighting. The sand oh freaking sand. Oh the sand is dragging you out of the track. What the hell is that? <laughs> yeah. It's super annoying in this track. Oh look at this, look at this. Uh, it was over. That was the last night, and that was the only occasion that I could have overtaken him. Ugh, oh, good lord. <sighs> Man. Man. <laughs> anyway. Second place, still on the podium. Not bad. And yeah, let's see the name of that car now. Mm, there is Motorstorm in that. Oh, well, Motorsport, I think, in the name. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Motors. Ha, ha, ha. Lycan. Okay. Lycan. What? Anyway. Anyway. That was it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. And like I said, starting from the next video. 
uh, you'll see some more interesting races where I will be probably struggling against good players. So yeah, thanks for watching and I will see you on the next one. Alright, God bless you and bye bye.